Okay, my students, we are going to solve this integration but numerically uh, by uh, knowing that the function is equal to x uh, exponential minus x dx uh, starting the integration from 0 0.4 to 4 while we have 6 elements 6 element means that delta x for each element under the curve is equal to 4 minus 0 0.4 upper limit to minus lower limit uh, divided by 6 the number of elements then we have 0 0.6 that means the distance of delta x now by starting from 0 0.4 and then adding delta x 0 0.6 we have 1 1.6 2.2 up to 4 so now the equation is the question is how we can find the value of f of x that means y f of x how we can find these values it is not suitable to substitute these values one by one into the equation and find the value of y but by using the calculator just go to the mod and we have the option number seven here is the table number seven okay just define the function now uh, just put at x alpha x times exponential shift then minus x okay go ahead uh, dx just left it for example one not uh, uh, not matter okay starting the integration from 0 0.4 okay this the lower limit and the end that means the upper uh, limit is uh, number four and the step of integration this is the step delta x is 0 0.6 okay equal to this value okay so at point four we have uh, 0 0.2681 this is the value of uh, 2681 uh, okay while at the number one yes you can find at the one uh, 0.3678 add at 1.6 uh, 0.323 and then go down 2.4 2.8 uh, 2.2 equal to 0.2437 and at the 2.8 0.1702 uh, at 3.4 is 0.1134 at and the number 4 we have 0 0.0732 okay this directly we got it now the uh, question is we can solve this equation directly by using the calculator okay uh, by using calculator okay just go to the computer and then we have this option uh, define the equation is uh, x times exponential minus x dx okay starting from okay uh, 0 0.4 and go to the upper limit is 4 and then we have to find the exact solution is equal to uh, 0 0.8 Four six uh, eight mm, six nine eight seven the exact solution right so now we can follow the uh, steps of Simpson rule method and solve this uh, equation numerically by hand but we uh, got a short time to find the value of f of x at each interval from 0 0.4 to 4 from lower limit to upper limit and then we can compare the uh, numerical result with the exact solution and find the uh, error percentage uh, I hope that this video is helpful for the students in engineering uh, college uh, in the subject of a numerical uh, analysis uh, my name is Dr. Hamdi Ahmed University of Ambar, College of Engineering, Department of Mechanical Engineering, Iraq. Thank you so much.